All eyes on Mauro Icardi in a rich vein of form and topping the scoring charts. Will he add more today on EA TV? And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary. And my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And we've got pulsating league action coming up for you. Stuart, your expectations? Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Can he take the chance? Oh, marvellous defending to deny him. Ivan Cavallero. Well, for Galatasaray, just what they wanted. A win last time out against Medipol Bashak Shahir. How might this one go, Stuart? Yes, that was the all-round team performance, wasn't it? They could have won by more than 3-0. Their fans absolutely loved it. Today, I'm expecting a similar outcome because they have that little bit of extra quality. It will be tight, though. Efkan Bekirolu. And winning it back. Decent effort there. Well, he has such good technique. He really did hit that well. He certainly came close there. On full credit to the visitors for the way they've gone about their defensive business. In fact, they're the number one team defensively in the league. Well, they don't concede too many goals, do they? And that comes down to their desire to stop the opposition playing. Whether it's pressing the ball high up the field or making them play predictably, they really are a good defensive team. Moving forward effectively. Disappointing pass. Icardi. Mertens. Now oh, that pass easy on the eye. Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. Can they forge ahead from this corner kick? Let's see. Well, they failed to get it away properly. Mount. Making sure nothing untoward happened. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. But it didn't end up being a significant advantage. And so a free kick here. Now looking dangerous here. Well, on the final analysis, it was good defending. And he read it well defensively. He continues his run. Can they take the lead? What a block! Rashica. Now, who can he play it to? Can he convert? And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Samba and taken away he won the ball a meaty but fair challenge and it will be a throw-in 
So a personnel change then. Zinedine Ferhat. Over the touchline for a throw in. A chance to whip it in. Well, Galatasaray haven't been able to dominate possession, but what they've done with it has been really good. And they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. They love to play on the counter attack. And fail to keep himself onside, unfortunately. Balkovets. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. An incisive pass. Mertens. Can he put it in? Marvellous anticipation. Lusamba. And Madja on the ball. Well, that ball looks promising. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Just 15 minutes remaining. Icardi. And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Mauro Icardi here. Will it be? And a goal! They lead by two now. And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily. Well, as you can see, he gave the keeper no chance there. He looked so confident, didn't he? That's a cool finish. So, 2-0 now. Mauro Icardi here. Perfect tackle. Cavaleiro. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Mauro Icardi here. And that is that. The referee blows his whistle for full time, and it's a victory for the visitors. Well, they've been great defensively, as we know. And a warm welcome on what is a fine day for football. I'm delighted to be able to report. My name is Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. And what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out, who will affect the game, and who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Well, for Galatasaray, you have to say it was a good performance and result in the last match against Alanya Sport. What do you expect to see this time, Stuart? Well, their 2 0 win was an excellent all round display, particularly the way they won the ball back. Today will be tougher, though, and I'm expecting a really close contest between two well drilled teams. I'm going for a draw as it's difficult to separate them. Mount. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Sam Larson. 
That was interesting to look at the table. And what can we say about these runaways, for want of a better word? Well, they're in a great position at the moment, as you mentioned, Derek. And you have to say their football has been exhilarating at times. If they can keep everybody fit, they should win the title comfortably. Couldn't hang on to it. A foul, but advantage played. Moving into the advanced position. But really sticking to their task defensively. Fernando. Wright has it. Ball back with Galatasaray now. Icardi. Not messing around with that clearance. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. It could be up for grabs. You don't often see that, do you? His own teammate getting in the way and a fairly straightforward offside. Well, I'm not quite sure why he's in that position. He's quite clearly offside. Something you don't see every day of the week. A triple substitution here. Well, as you can see, it's been really tight and neither side has taken enough risk going forward. Oh, goodness. Not the best of challenges. Now then, what's the referee going to do here? Well, he's going to be taking no further part in this match. Well, it's not a clever challenge, is it? They're going to have to dig in now. Balji in the right place to cut out the pass cleared away comprehensively the first half here comes to an end to the second half then and these two sides are locked together just can't really choose between them at the moment Sam Larson Freddie and scope for them to produce something exciting but timely defending when it mattered this might be ideal for the counter well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Shoya Nakajima. And a long way out here. And a good take under duress there. Well, nicely cut out. And continues his run. Well, we're into the final half hour. Oh, fancy footwork. And the cross goes in. Well cleared away. Right now. Dow. This looks promising. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Splendid defending, and it needed to be.
Patrick Van Aanholt. And room now out on the flank. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Dow. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Oh, lovely ball. Well, he had just gone beyond the last defender, Stuart. Well, that's a real shame because the through ball is really well weighted, but he just took too long to play it. And Anholt. Now with Mount. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Plenty of support here. Can they push ahead in the closing stages? Can they forge ahead? No way through. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. This to open the scoring here. And in it goes. As coolly as you like. Never in any doubt from the spot. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Right. On the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Can he finish? Determined defending. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be... All eyes on Dries Mertens. Four goals in three games. You can't argue with that. The action is live. Next. Well, most of the fans in attendance here have had to bring their umbrellas and wear their raincoats. It's a soggy day for this match. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner, Stuart Robson. And we've got what we hope will be exciting league action coming up for you. Stuart, your expectations? Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Chance to play it in. Mensah able to get a body in the way. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. This to make it 1-0. Goal! Taking aim from the spot and finding the target. And the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? It's looking promising. And there's the feed into the box. And a no-nonsense clearance. And he cuts inside. Making sure it didn't get past him. It's there for him. Determined defending. Oh, the referee has given it. Penalty it is.
And this for 1 1. The keeper going in the right direction and saving it. Now, how about the short corner? And he takes it on. They couldn't maintain possession. Carlos Mane. In the right place to cut out the pass. Well, you can really sense the frustration building around the stadium. They've been so poor today, way below their usual standard. And play halted, free kick given. And deep into the penalty area. And super tackle and they've won possession. And space to attack, but quick thinking defensively. Now options are plenty. And over the touchline for what'll be a Galatasaray throw. Torreira. Mauro Icardi here. Chances on. Spectacular save. Top class goalkeeping. Mario Gavranovic. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Misfiring completely. Yeah, he's gone for power, but the contact was never right. It's a poor effort, really. And they do like to press whenever they can. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. And so it is, the first half story. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Civelec. Olivier Kemen. Gavranovic with it. Untidy in possession. He has teammates around him. Ramazan Jibelek. And he read it well, intercepting it. Good movement. And really closing him down. They couldn't hang on to it again. Unable to get himself back onside here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. Really good interception. 30 minutes to go then. And he read it superbly. And a creative look about this. But timely defending when it mattered. Mertens. Can he finish? Just made sure. Well, that's a foul. And it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. And time for the change now. Just can't get it past the wall. Oh, the keeper needed to do an awful lot better. Icardi. 
bodies forward and the break looks on well, with tackling like that the onus is on the referee to take action potentially Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Will he find the net? Still alive. And a time for calm on the ball. Well, I don't think they've been at it today, but maybe, just maybe, that great save will inspire them now. Well, not out of the woods just yet. This still could be dangerous. Mensah. Got to it easily, the keeper. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between the sides. And with that, the attack fizzles out. A meaty but fair challenge and it will be a throw-in. Substitution time as is here. Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. He's got to score! How about this for drama? All even once more. Astonishing! Well, let's take another look, and there's the deflection. And from that moment on, the keeper had no chance, did he? And so the final whistle has sounded. At the end of the game, the team is not...